Hey there friends and enemies, Jopi here again and today we got a brand new gameplay preview trailer for AI Limit and this game looks very interesting to me. I am definitely looking forward to what I've seen so far. So let's react to the trailer together and see what the hype is all about. <laughs> I'm feeling the vibes already. Interesting. Once you've met humans. In the last city of humanity. Heavenswell. Oh, this looks interesting. Imagine that they once ruled this very world. Post-apocalyptic. It's a realm surrounded by springs and waterfalls where flowers bloom and trees thrive. Now it's the monsters. Oh, I was not expecting this. Okay. In heaven's world. And humans are just sheep. Looks like near or a souls like type jam. Just from the combat, uh, a constant combat, a lot of parrying, a lot of dodging. Seeking after far fetched goals with crippled memories. However, oh. giant boss, just a feeble another giant boss, yeah. Make a joke and call it anime Elden Ring. <laughs> While the branch can infinitely reconstruct your physical form, oh, that must be how you come back from death. Oh, that's a giant dude. Okay. Yeah, these bosses look pretty sick. Please proceed with courage and caution. Oh, yeah. Branch guide your path. Interesting. Yeah, so if you're a fan of Souls like games, I think this is gonna be right up your alley. It looks I don't know how hard the combat is gonna be to be honest, but it has that vibe, right? That it's going to be a darker, harder game, maybe a little bit more futuristic than a lot of Souls like games are focused on, which I think is a good thing. Take it into a new era, essentially. And yeah, we'll have to wait and see how the gameplay feels. That's the big key thing with this game is it all comes down to how good the parrying feels if that system is done correctly, how good the dodging feels if you really are able to master combat. Because some games that come out, uh, either they're a little janky, so the the controls don't register easily enough so it doesn't feel like your timing can get perfected as well whereas the beauty of a game like Elden Ring or Bloodborne or something like that is that you can really perfect your combat ability so that you are mastering the game and so that's going to be a big de decision on how good this game is and then the other part is going to be the actual story content and whether or not it's going to be engaging because I feel like a lot of people are trying to go down this path of Souls-like games without having enough of the the world building that is necessary. You look at a game like Elden Ring or Bloodborne, one of the best parts about those types of games is the fact that it is so interesting and uh, there is a lot of layers and depth to the world as a whole and the things that you can uncover so that'll all impact how good this game is how well received it is it looks interesting i think i could have a lot of fun with this one i'm not particularly great at souls like games but i do enjoy trying them out seeing how far i can get and testing my abilities so if you enjoyed the video hit that like button subscribe to the channel helps me out tremendously shows you want to see more content from ai limit and other souls like games on the channel if you want to see me struggle bus through definitely let me know in the comments down below my name is jopa have a good one and i'll catch you all later